Lucas, congratulations on the win, man. Uh, you've had plenty of victories at this point, but do you think that was your best performance today? Uh, I mean, absolutely, it was definitely my quickest. Um, you know, he came out with a different plan than uh, we had expected. And yeah, yeah, yeah I mean, I, I felt great. I felt great on the feet. And my, my choke felt tight as soon as I had it. You know, yeah, 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 I felt great. What did you think he was going to do? Uh, a, lot, a lot of his previous uh, experience, hard, hard pressure. Um, has a wrestling background, you know, and I knew that. I, I sent that body kick and I, I jumped for his neck, but I also instantly felt nothing was touching the ground. So, you know, I thought I was going for a ride. Uh, thankfully, I wasn't, but, you know, uh, that's on me. Uh, but, yeah, he, he was much more patient. And d despite uh, how short it might have seemed, he was much more patient, patient than his previous fights. And when you finally, when you, when you got that choke and you guys went round and round for a while, and you, you, you had it, you know, you were, you were working on it for a while. Did you know that you had it? Did you feel pretty comfortable despite, you know, spinning and whatnot? So I knew my grip was good, right? That, that, that's something that I, I use every single day. And everyone I train with knows I, I live in that position. And so uh, once my grip was together, I was solid. It was just a matter of putting myself in a position where if it didn't work, I was safe. You know, I didn't want to end up on bottom. I didn't want to end up with him in side control. I knew I needed to come up to that ending position where I won. Just so in case it didn't work, I was safe uh, from that point forward. Is that a confidence booster at all that you can make those sort of adjustments? I mean, he did, he did pretty much everything he could to try to escape what you were doing, and, and you still pulled it no, oh, absolutely, and, and he was doing all the right things. He was trying to jump all the right angles. He he, uh, he was making all the right decisions. I think I was just making better decisions uh, in in that aspect. With all uh, disrespect or respect to him. All right, I'll take you. a few more questions here. Jeff, go ahead. Jeff Bradley from the Man in the Cage podcast. Lucas, congrats. Uh, last time out, listen, the W is a W, but you didn't find the finish. You find the first round finish here. Was that important for you tonight to find that finish in this way and make that extra little exclamation mark to everybody? Uh, I mean, I mean, yeah, having a have finish is great. Uh, first round finish, I guess, is even better. You know, it's absolutely my fastest. Um, but I'm not, I'm not worried about, uh, you know, how, how it looks on my record, if it's a finish or a decision or whatever. I want, I want a good performance, and I want a good performance for me, you know. So uh, I'm, I'm happy to come away with the win, uh, you know, pretty much unharmed. Thanks, Lucas. Michelle? Hey, how you doing, Lucas? Congrats on the first win. Thank you, sir. Or ma'am. Oh, my God. <laughs> Maybe I got hit. <laughs> Uh, I didn't. I didn't catch that very last part you just said. I'm sorry. Could you repeat that? Okay. So, uh, you got the win. So, what will you be doing for like the next week or two with the big win? All right. Uh, yeah. Sorry about that. I. Uh, I mean, just just recovering. You know, I had a very long camp. Uh, this this fight, this whole car was originally scheduled for much sooner. So, I, I've been in training camp for a very long time, and uh, I've manage to keep myself relatively healthy but I've definitely had to deal with a handful of injuries and uh, health concerns so I'm definitely going to be taking the next like week or two eat some things that aren't on my diet and uh, and just kind of enjoy myself before I uh, get back into intense training again. Dylan? Hello Lucas, appreciate you making some time. I was just curious because I'd seen some stories heading into this one where it was saying you were wanting more of an active schedule, you were just saying you want a bit of time to recover, but like, if you want a quick turnaround, I mean, you got a pretty quick victory tonight, so I imagine it could be facilitated. Uh, I mean, I'm definitely healthy for a quick turnaround, you know, I'm never opposed to it. Uh, I've, I've, I've been in camp since Thanksgiving. Uh, I've been on a, a very intense diet since, since the weekend of Thanksgiving, and so, you know, I'm definitely, I want to take a minute to let my body recover. You know, I have quite a handful of injuries that I'm just kind of nursing, uh, and, you know, I'm grateful to make it through the weekend. Uh, you know that it was that it was so quick and relatively uh, harmless, and um, yeah, I uh, I'm not opposed to a quick turnaround, but I would like a minute to uh, just kind of get my body back up to where I'd like it to be, uh, be a little more comfortable there. Yeah, I gotta say we're a great win too. Appreciate the time. Thank you, sir. Last question here, Lou. Hey, Lucas, congratulations on the win. Thank you. Uh, also, Luke from the Empire Universe podcast. <laughs> uh, is this the way you saw the fight ending, and is it time for a ranked opponent? Uh, in, it is a form of way I saw the fight ending, you know. Chokes are a big thing of mine that I, uh, I was happy to be able to get it off. I didn't expect it as quickly as I did, uh, let alone uh, the setup for it. You know, I believe the whole transition while while I think I would need to watch it again, uh, was definitely a little different from what I envisioned. Uh, being ranked, yeah. Uh, man, I'm not, I'm not here to 
call out anyone or try and you know try try and do anything crazy like that. I I'm happy with a successful career as far as that goes, and just continuing to uh, to win fights as as opposed to a handful of people that have been telling me I uh, I should ask to be ranked. Uh, you know I I prefer to move forward as humbly as possible and just continue uh, refining what I'm working on. Thanks for the time, Lucas. Congrats on the win. Thank you, sir.